What's the name of it again, Glen? Glen Haven. Glen, Glen Haven Cemetery in Silmar. And we're ghost hunting. We bring Channel 36 to the cemetery with the ghost hunters, Josh and Chad. And their company is called Imandala Paranormal. And they're here with us. And Raul is our technician. And Homer's here. And I'm here, the rain steward. I'm here. Homer, you're just here. I'm here. Kind of on the way I'm here. <laughs> on, it does that. <laughs> yeah. So that's what you're going to see oh, if like something shaking. happens. Yeah. Usually, like, it'll, you see how it hits the orange? Yeah. You'll just, it'll just be, like, random out of nowhere. Okay. So, this is <laughs> here we are, Josh, Chad, Homer. Say that. And Raul's there in the camera art. Technical director here tonight. <laughs> the best of the best. I still can't believe we're here at this time of night when other people are cozy in their bed, but we prefer to be in the cemetery. <laughs> oh, we are. There's, we're gonna there's walk. a room up here. A room for what? There's a, like a it's mausoleum. A mausoleum. Room. And we've actually sat in there alone before, and we've actually spoke to like a little girl. Oh, man. Right. <laughs> Raul, can we all go in there? I mean, we're yeah, all sticking together we did this, here. We actually did no one's pairs going of two people at a time separately. and just shoved them in there. Are we, can all of us go in there? Oh, uh, we can try. I, I think it's a little small. Because it's a small area. It's not a full mausoleum. Separate. Well, I mean, we'll, we'll be on the outside. I could go with you if you with you guys if you want to. And well, I'm not going to go in there by myself. <laughs> what did I just say? I said I'll go in there with okay, you guys. Okay, that's fine. That's great. Okay. So, that, that's fine. Are you guys ready? Uh, yeah, we're ready. Actually, we're going to go into the mausoleum. <gasps> okay. Uh, depending on if everybody leaves down there from the service later on, there's a child cemetery at the front of the at the front of the cemetery. Uh-huh. And supposedly the statue in the child cemetery is supposed to be it moves. So people have reported it being in different positions and it being uh, gone sometimes in the middle of the oh night. Oh my goodness. So. It's gone in the middle the, of the night? There's reports of it being, you know, not where it's <laughs> supposed to be. And there's reports of it being in different positions, positions. from the last night. Now there are a lot of people this. at the cemetery down there because they're having services tonight. So down the hill, there are a lot of people there, and, but we are up high on this canyon road. At the top. Way up high. Way up. Follow us. Let's go. Watch your step. Wait, I have to put the light on. So, I, 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 I don't no. like spiders. I, I don't like it. bugs. It's <laughs> all right. We don't need it. So this is it right here. The ghost Our charger back here. So we got the last time. Thank you. It looks like somebody's living room. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the ceiling. Are you guys ready? Wow, okay. Ladies first. Ladies first. Oh, I'll go second. <laughs> <laughs> so this is actually where we get most of our activity. I think all of us could fit in here. Mm -hmm. So the last time we were in here, we got a few voices. Mm -hmm. uh, we that also thing was jumping off the meter. Yeah, we also were getting a lot of activity in the corner. Mm -hmm. Both really, corners. the corners? Both corners, actually, so. Oh. So we'll go ahead and shut this from the outside uh -oh, world. I'm getting. Oh, oh. Already? Oh, oh, yeah. It jumped. Go ahead and shut the light off. Yeah, so the, the camera will pick that up. It jumped. Oh. Turn your light off. It shows better. Yeah, because you can't see it. Your, your, your flashlight. Turn your light off. Okay. You push the button. I'm <laughs> the button. Jet on that way. It's in the back. Mike. My gloves are in the way. Okay, okay let's wait and stand in like a clap circle. Light. I know. Oh my goodness. Can you touch the meter again for us, please? It was back here. What was that? Where it, it was right <laughs> here. Yeah, where what was that? It was a phone. Her phone? Why is her phone talking? She said her phone was in the car. No, her phone's in the car. What the what was that? <laughs> Over here. Is your phone with you? <laughs> My phone is with me, but it's off. What about yours? 
Touch her hand, please. She wants to help you. I'm not yeah, where was that? What was that? Was outside. I was outside. Will you touch my hand? Okay, you guys. So what this is is it's called a spare box. When you hear the little that's radio stations being ch uh, channeled through. So what they say is the spirit, if you hear more than like a voice, uh -huh. if you hear maybe like, like a solid word, yeah, it's across three or four channels. Mm -hmm. So it's impossible to be a radio station because it's so it's usually so many. it's usually paranormal. So like a sentence or anything like that is usually paranormal. And I hear I do hear her coming through, so we'll see if we can talk to her. Maybe we'll, we'll do a couple things. Uh, you guys can see how we, we use. Uh, what is what do you call security question? Yeah. Uh -huh. you know, so. Huh? 
all like we're not doing anything to You can hear them. You can hear them. They actually love talking. They love hearing their voice over and over again. The ghost whisper. Can you say loud and clear so everybody can hear you? Can you say hello? Loud and clear, please. Wow. 
much fun. That time I was looking at this light and it looked like this light was dancing around in the chair. Which one? That one? Yeah. Are you drunk? <laughs> when yeah. when did that happen? <laughs> well, now? I was looking at the light and the light kept going like so different like places. Around? Really? Holding it yeah. from the bottom here on the Whoa. bright things. Because you're... Wow. That light, yeah, that light yeah, will yeah, swivel back. Well, well, so there's yeah, a handle there. You can move it over and then play. Use your other hand maybe hold it here. That light will move back and forth. Yeah, so... I know you were holding it earlier and it looked like it shifted Yeah, if it shifted, yeah. Yeah, because that light tilts. Wow. You need help or you're okay with That's it? That's very I'm powerful. Good. I really actually got the chills that went all the way out of my spine. <laughs> oh. And that wasn't even the best of it yet. We haven't heard anything yet. Mm -hmm. uh, except for the voices. That, I mean, well, that, except that, for my that, phone. In this, in this area, <laughs> actually, we've heard audible where we didn't have that. We were just sitting in here and, and they voices. got told to go away and other girls got told, you know, like, I'm here or help me or... Uh -huh. And it's actual audible. You can hear it. You right. know? And that's really, that's the bone tingling one. That's, whoa, what the hell? Where's yeah, that? It's okay. a voice that can't, you, you know, there's nowhere for it to come from. Yeah, but you, it's like you can tell, like you're sitting here and it's over here. You're like, okay, well, there's nothing here. So it's really, really chilling. It's amazing. Oh, oh. Because, uh, Okay, are we going to go out and walk yes, around yeah. okay, and just we'll see? It's going to be really windy, so I mean, audio could get... Um, here, really... let me get this meter here. Oh, it's on the bottom. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh, okay. the light just, the red well, light. Well, if on. you scrape it or anything like that, it'll... Yeah, it'll, it'll jump if you... Have it'll jump? Too much. Okay. Oh, wow, it's right now. Okay, so also be careful right here. I've actually seen, like, a guy and a girl walking right here. You have? Yeah. We're outside of the mausoleum now. You need help now. with that camera? Or you're okay. Whoa. <laughs> we'll get sprayed. Yeah, all well, the sprinklers are on. Oh, it's probably close this door, huh? Yeah. Sorry about that. I don't know the directions. I'm thinking if we walk along the walkway here, we're going to walk around the sprinklers. Oh. And there's another mausoleum over there if you guys want to try that one. Yeah, yeah that one's yeah. got black really, widows yeah, all over it. We don't really get anything over there, and it's got a lot of spiders. Oh, I don't want any spiders. Yeah, no, we don't, we don't need that. Yeah, they're, 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 they're widows. widows. I don't want to go down yeah, that, that way. That's a lot of widows. It's true. It's a light that right is a motion light, and it doesn't reach this far. So it's gone on three times since we've gotten here. What does that mean? Uh, it, well, it picks up only motion, so... and. Nobody's been walking up here, and nobody's been walking in that area. Oh my goodness! Did that light's turned itself on three times. Oh, did you hear that? Oh my goodness! They're around here looking at us. Oh, they are. Try that little circle area there. What was that? I just saw lights. Where? Did you see that? Between the trees, something. There's a lot of deer out here. Yeah, they could possibly be deer. Oh. They, they, they shine back. Like into the hearts of the As they walk around and eat the grass. What they say is because it's so windy, there's a bunch of houses over there, and sometimes voices will travel. They travel because, yeah, of, that. because of like the wind and everything like that. So that possibly could be what it is. Or maybe like the said, ghost. We'll have to go through. You know something? Maybe this is the rest period. Maybe they're at certain times. Like, could be. So. I thought you don't get scared no more. Oh, no, he gets scared. I'm one of them. Yeah, Josh is calm. Chad is the one that... Okay, well, have you noticed that you heard me? Is anybody around besides us? Of course, there are a lot of you around. But... <laughs> Will you make some contact with us? Please? Did you just get turned back because on? Because it's, it's getting very cold up here. How do you stand it? <laughs> My goodness gracious. And the body? Wow. Did you turn your back on? Or mine? Yeah, or did you hit the button or all? Uh-uh. Because it went off in your hand. Just make contact with this, okay? Flicker the light. Do something, please. Lauren, go ahead and turn yours off and turn it back on real quick. Really?
Damn. Either meet her if you're here, you can, you can uh, talk to me. Let's try it. Okay, let's all come right here. We're going to go down to the children's so, cemetery so now, okay? okay? So, uh, also here we've gotten pictures of orbs in this area. Um, we had a car, where was your car parked? Right here. Yeah. One Where of the members was either. feeling uneasy in the car. sit in the car so she came and sat in the back seat you know and all of a sudden she gets out of the car and she's just like freaking out she's like something came up and tapped on the window she's like i heard tapping on the window from the outside and oh. we had the spare box and the kid we heard kids like yeah that was me yeah we well, were using the spirit box at the time wow so. wow so we're gonna go over and we're gonna walk up right pretty much on top of where the statue is Oh wow. That must have been one of the memorial of a child. Okay, gentlemen, lead the way. Man, we we'll prepared for last time. Yeah, this is the okay. statue that. No, it just says grandmother and child. It's because this is the children. It's supposed to be like um, comforting. And like I said, this is the statue that supposedly gets up and walks around and. It moves. Supposedly. Yeah. Did you hear that? This supposedly. is the statue that moves. They see it in different positions all the time. That is eerie, isn't it? Got you. It's beautiful, though. It really is, Homer. <laughs> That's a beautiful statue. But, I mean, at first it's okay, and then later on in the night, it, it actually did get extremely eerie, and everybody didn't want to be around it. So Except for me. I like to prop you up. Should I put the meter on the statue? Yeah, if you want to prop yeah, it up want. against the front. Okay, I'm going to put the, front. the meter on the right. bottom. Prop it there in front. And please make contact with us. Okay? Turn your light off. We're nice people. We don't want to hurt you. Make contact with us, okay? Can you light up the meter she just put down on the statue? Yeah. It's a box. Flying across the ground. Oh, you ain't so badass now, huh? <laughs> <laughs> and here we are again. Oh, okay. At the cemetery. What's the name of it again, Glen? Glen Haven. Glen, Glen Haven Cemetery in Silmar. Yeah, yeah. And we're ghost hunting. We bring Channel 36 to the cemetery with the ghost hunters, Josh and Chad. And they're company is called a mandala paranormal and they're here with us and Raul is our technician and Homer's here and I'm he's here the rain steward I'm here I'm here we picked him up on the way he was hitchhiking Santa Monica Boulevard. <laughs> Look at those people. But oh, it's, no. it's been a, it's an awesome trip. I mean, I will never, never forget this night, never. And I'm so glad we're here the with the crew and everything. <laughs> Josh and Chad are really good at these things. Excellent. First one to try it, last one to survive. What's that in your hand? 
Oh, uh, this is the holy water. <laughs> I'm still carrying the holy water here. And the flashlight and the rosaries here. What can I tell you? I don't know if they told you. We're, we're all prepared. Our, uh, our team but we're letting them know we don't want to do any harm. We so just want to meet some nice ghosts. And, and that's it. Just make contact and see what happens. Of course, we heard the voices up there in the mausoleum. And as we walked around, we heard some more voices. Yeah. I'm telling you. It, I said it gives me the chills all the way up my spine. I started shaking inside. You know, pushing that theory into the paranormal. Uh, you have to experience something like this, you know, and after you experience this, you know what we mean and how we feel and everything. You know, to kind of try and quell things and, you know, settle stuff down. So far it seems to work. There are a lot of people that don't believe in ghosts, of course. We do, and they do, and Josh and Chad, because they've had experiences. And... That's why you really believe I've had experiences. Raul, have you had experiences <laughs> mm -hmm. with ghosts? So that's why we were so interested in doing this. And a lot of people just don't believe in ghosts. I believe the spirit just leaves the body. And some people feel like they're still on earth here and they're not dead at all. So I think that's why they try to come back. And I don't even think they know they disappear, do they? No. No, Most of the time they don't. They're, they're not aware of that. Mm -hmm. They just do their same daily routine over and over every single day. Well, I heard that some spirits have trouble ascending up, so they're longer here on Earth. Mm -hmm. They want to stay longer here, right? Um, sometimes not necessarily. Most, a lot of places are... I mean, we've run into a few A lot of places, um... A lot of spirits will be like, you know, help me, I'm stuck here. You know, what's wrong? Oh, him. Uh huh. Yeah. Would they ever say, help me, help me, help me? No, we've actually got a lot of help me to get a lot of, like, eerie stuff like that, you know. And it's usually either help me or go away. It's never a whole place trying to make conversation.